Well, we discharged the officers, and uh, Tommy Bear uh, said a lot to the discharged officers of what, how meaningful they were to the viability of, of our organization. Uh, we're a volunteer organization, we're a leadership organization, and fortunately we have volunteers willing to assume a lot of responsibility because they're given up their free time. So uh, the new ones that are coming in, I hope they uh, take notice of those who were discharged because they really did a tremendous job. From the early days of our history, we have venerated leaders. In the fourth century, when our ancestors wrote the Talmud, they recognized the kind of imprint leaders placed upon the group that they lead. And the Talmud says, as the generation, so the leader. As the leader, so the generation. All of you being elected tonight have as one of your passions a deep affection and long association with the neighborhood. As volunteers, you have been deeply involved in the work of our organization, and you have seen firsthand the impact we can make for Jewish interests and humanitarian concerns. So being elected to the highest levels of the neighborhood is an honor and attests to the high regard you are held, held in to help assist our president. For nearly 170 years, B'nai B'rith has enabled us to do meaningful things, and our leadership has shown the way. Our volunteer leaderships have been the hallmark of the B'rith, and you have been elected to continue that awesome tradition. So let me first call back on our uh, Chief Justice, Billy Perez. Billy, would you come forward? You know, Billy and I go back to days when we used to travel to Israel, and he would lead me all around. And uh, one of the good things, probably one of the treasured things about the neighborhood is the friends you meet and the acquaintances you make. All around the world, sitting here, you have people from all different parts, and we know each other. So Billy, it really is an honor to install you as the Chief Justice of the neighborhood. Now I'm going to uh, install the international officers. Uh, will the um, senior vice presidents all come forward, please? And that's Ira Bartfeld, Leon Burberger, Chuff Kaufman, Daniel Zatone. I'm Katz. And Ross Klein, uh, who is also a senior, uh, was re-elected, but she is no longer here.
information is very valuable because we who are on the Fed Budget Committee know all the work that you have done to help us get through some very critical times. So it really is an honor uh, to read uh, your, your re-elected to serve another three-year term. And congratulations yes, to you for the fine work that you've been doing for us so much. And now we have the senior uh, vice president. And you know, to be a senior in our organization is really uh, a top honor because they really work with the president, they help the president, they help all of us in the various assignments that they are given. So I take great in installing all of you as senior vice president of the Negro International and to signify your office, each one of you are going to get a beautiful international pin as a senior uh, vice president. International, Mazel Tov, and now we can go. 